Nada. Welcome to Shopping to Scale, Reese and Crafts. If you join me, I appreciate the join today. We're going to be making a shabby chic wreath today using the character board. Um, we're going to make the decorations as we go, so we're going to wing it. So what we'll be using today will be um, the character board. Um, and I ordered a digital print from Unique in the Creek, which you can purchase and download them and send them over to um, Staples, and they'll print them off. And um, then you'll bring them back, and you'll uh, cut out the circle, and you'll put it in the middle of your frame and Mod Podge it on. Hold on just a second, please. Here's what we're going to be doing. This is a unique in the creek board, character board. With the character board, what makes it different than the flower board is it does not consist of holes in here. It's just solid. And what happens is um, it allows you to modge podge anything that you can uh, locate, your decorations, etc., in the middle. For suggestions, um, you can pick up a nice gift bag. If you have a nice gift bag and you really like it, then you can take and cut it out to be the size of this, Mod Podge it on, Mod Podge over it to seal it. Once you seal it, you want to spray it where it'll give you that extra protection from the weather. And you'll spray that with Krylon Clear, and it gives you a little extra. Um, like I said, today um, I want to introduce you to start with, to my little sister, Kimberly, uh, she's visiting from Ohio. We kind of kidnapped her and brought her, brought her home for a little bit where she could learn the ropes. And she's doing our technical behind the scenes. So if you see things popping up on the screen, she's going to learn to answer as she can. Here's Kimberly. Hi, Say hi. hi. Uh, if you don't mind, give her, show her a little love. Um, and we'll go from there. Uh, we're learning some of this technical as we go, so it's been a challenge. We think we have mini chat set up, so hopefully if you start typing in alert, um, we hope that that will allow you to receive notifications when we go live. We're going to try that. All right. Um, like I said, I have already mod podged my decal on, or my print onto the board, and it's dried and ready to go. I've already inserted the twine for the hanging. This is what the back of it looks like. Like I said, it's different than the flower board. It has a solid center. So that allows you to do quite a bit with it. It's unique. Um, along with this, we're going to be using some of these flowers. We're going to incorporate some of these flowers. Uh, we're going to incorporate some of these um, other flowers like this. We're going to add these in. I'm even going to put in a little bit of cotton balls. I really think that these will add a little extra touch. And the um, highlight of the wreath will be a rag bow that I created or made last night. And um, this is what it's going to look like. And it will go in the at the bottom of the wreath right about here and once we get down there and get the mesh on then we'll go from 